Brian, where'd you find this? Pull up in a judo. Hello and welcome back to Kingdom Hearts 2 Final Mix Critical Mode Episode 3, everybody. We are about to start about the last match of the Struggle Tournament. Let's do it. Let's see here. Last match, I don't know if y'all remember, but we unlocked Scan. So, yeah, we'll see what we can do with this. See if we can't run this, run this struggle. Scan makes everything so much easier. Ooh. Nice try, pal. Nice try. Yeah, he got me. So, this is hardly a gamble. Shit. He got me. That's fine. That's fine, guys. You know, I don't think I've ever lost to this guy. So I have no clue. Thanks for the win, partner. This is for you. So if you lose, you get something from him. That's... That's weird. Like, I literally have never lost. <laughs> Clap for the loser, everybody. Metal increases strength. Wow. And I still get the struggle trophy? But I lost. And we are falling. And let's go ahead and save it. Just so we don't have any mishaps happen, you know? Yeah, um... Let's see, where are we supposed to go? I think it's the Sandlot, right? No, pretty sure we're going to Station Heights. Up here to the train station to go and check out the wonders. The seven wonders of the world. This guy. Let's see. Grand Central Station. It's come. Our hunt for the Seven Wonders begins. The Seven Wonders. Let's see. The first wonders was the stairs, I believe. Get the animated bag. It's just, the, just the dog. This whole sequence to me was just pointless. Like, completely pointless. But I might as well play through it for you guys. Um, yeah, I guess you guys deserve to see the whole game being played through. Ooh, yeah, I got it. <sighs> let's go ahead and let's equip this this metal why not right it gives us 50 extra was that was that 50 extra No, it just gives us one extra strength. Okay. That's not too good, but not too bad. I mean, we're still gonna beat on all these VVs right now. Yeah. Uh, 
would be so nice if Roxas actually had magic. And we did it. It would be so much nicer if Roxas really did have magic. Like, at least thunder? That'd be great. Alright, on to the next wonder. Which is the Shadow Clone Roxas. <laughs> the soundtrack to me for Twilight Town is so mellow, I love it. Makes me feel so relaxed. Leave a like if it does for you too. Man, this, this guy is just, he's, he's me, but he's like a weaker me. But he also finishes combos through regardless if it connects or not. So that's a good thing, I guess. But I still just, it, it's like, this whole sequence is pointless, absolutely pointless. You could have just let me get straight to Sora and start exploring worlds and go to Yen Sid's castle and all that good stuff, but no. You just had to let me do the seven wonders of the world. Hmm. I forgot there's a lot of chests in this one, in this place over here. <sighs> Let's see how. I think I missed one somewhere. No? Okay, cool. On our way to the last wonder. Which is literally just the dog in the bag. Hmm. On another note, I wish they would have uh, made 358 over 2 playable. That would have been nice. I've, I've never had the chance to play 358. I've never owned a console that could play it, so that would just be amazing, I mean, to really get in depth with Roxas and the organization and all that, perfect, it would be a great game to be remastered onto a console and not just what they did with 1.5 and 2.5 HD Remix, where they made it a cinematic, that was ridiculous, I hated that. Let's see, let's go solve the mystery at the hill. And I was just up there, why couldn't I stay up there? Games these days. You wanna have you run all over the place and go back to the place you just came from. But that's fine. We're just gonna skip the cutscene anyway. Let's see, the hole in the tram come all leads to the haunted mansion. Let's get on the skateboard. Whoa, whoa. Let's see if I can't hit a couple tricks for y'all. And then we're gonna grind it up right here. And I'm going straight to the tram com. So much easier to get around on a skateboard in this game. Off into the woods. I still think it's funny how you main the struggle baton. Like, it's just, it's amazing. They're just like, you know what? We're gonna give you guys struggle batons for the first opening sequence of the game. You know and occasionally give you the Keyblade, you know? Wakey wakey Roxas. Wakey wakey. <laughs> so glad he doesn't have those clown shoes anymore. Oh my god. Skip it on. We gotta save it. We gotta save it, guys. Do do do. Super excited for my second fight with Axel. It's 
It's gonna be great. Get to dual wheel Oblivion and Oathkeeper. You guys don't even understand how much scan makes this so much easier fighting these nobodies and stuff. It's just, it, it, it helps so much. Like, oh, I hate these ones. The ones that go into the ground. Got him. I think I'm gonna make this video a little bit longer, guys. Let's see, he is completely halted. Off to the station heights. Going to the mansion. Just gonna skip every fight I need to to get there. Do, 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 do. Going to find Sora in the pod. Do, 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 do. Jump over the nobodies. Keep on running into the hole in the wall. Dun dun dun. Run through the woods, run through the woods, running through the, running through the, running through the woods. Off to the old mansion to see what the hell is up with this place. Let's see. Gotta go to Nominee's room. Which I believe is this one? Yeah, it's this one right here. Gotta get the, the drawing. Yeah, better save. Key point, always save. If you guys remember before they did the HD remaster for the PlayStation 4 version, there was a thing on the PlayStation 3 where it corrupted your save files randomly. So always, always save at a save point. 110%. Every time I see a save point, you're gonna see me save. That's just how I am. Let's see, well. Time to fight Axel. I've always wondered what was behind this door. It would be so cool if somebody was like, went into free mode, free camera mode, and went behind that door. Super cool. Oh, wait, look at that, another save point. Right before our boss battle. Yes, sir. I would like to overwrite my existing save file. Um, we got some potions. We'll automatically connect that. <sighs> Let's go get some dual wield action. Right after a short break from these nobodies. It's crazy, I'm on a, I'm doing a proud mode thing on my personal, like, not uploading it to YouTube, and, um, it's so much harder for proud than it is for critical, it's ridiculous. Would have been nice if uh, Roxas had guard too, but that's okay. We have the second uh, finisher attack. So okay. Only one more nobody stands between me and my dual wield keyblades. God, I wish you can just simply mainly do that. That'd be so cool. Like, I wish you didn't have to go into a dry form to do this. Ooh, I'm 
my shit kicked in already, fellas. Overtake? Bitch. Try to use a potion when I get back out of it. The combos are just so insane. Like, look at this, man. Got him. Let's go, baby. Let's fucking go. Now to uh, go wake up Sora. Let's do it. Let's do it. Grab that high pot. Mr. Diz. Oh boy, alrighty. There's everybody. Oh, I got guard. Yeah, guard, guard, guardy, guard, guard. You can now view the status of your parties. Alright, let's see. Uh, I gotta get the Yinsid's castle and we'll change that goofy ass freaking get up. But I think that's gonna be it for this video, guys. If you enjoyed the video, please leave a like, comment if you're new, subscribe, share my stuff, get me out there. I'm so close to my goal of 85 by December. I'm at 75 now, I'm only 10 away. And if we could set this video for. 15 likes, 4 comments, that'd be perfect guys, anyways this has been Evo, I hope you enjoyed it, peace.